Last time on Breaking Beige. Ah! Here it is. Welcome to my humble abode. Usually I'm in the down mood. We have to bring some of this style into here. Oh, yes. Your new dresser. Wow. That's what we're going to paint the walls with. In a beige, beige world, Mr. Kate is on a mission to break it. One, two, three! Oh my god! Oh my god, it's perfect! So join us! Joey, we get it! You're really manly! This is scary. Joey! Joey. Hello. This is crazy, we gotta clean this up. May I take your order? Uh, kale salad, maybe some toasted almond. Wow. I got that, the kale salad. Ew, God, toasty it's, oh almond. my God, it's so dusty. We can't bring in new, beautiful stuff into Cassie's room until we get rid of the old, broken stuff. Thank you, and have a wonderful meal. Wow, I'm really glad I came back here. Rude. Okay. Yeah. In place of the ceiling fan, we're adding a vintage blingy chandelier to bring in a luxurious vibe. We're painting a coat of white paint to completely refresh Cassie's stained and dingy walls. Oh wait, Cassie didn't get to cover up her scuff marks. Wait, I wanna go get her, hang on. Ta-da! Wow, it's so bright. Yes, it's so bright in here. It makes it much bigger space. Yeah, right? I wanted you to have a moment where you could cover some of these scuff marks over here. Woo. I'm gonna go work on a secret project. Centered. My secret project is a charcoal sketch I'm doing based off of the photo shoot I did with Cassie looking all cool with her swagger. Oh, speed. Uh, what, what are you guys doing? Are you done? We're on lunch break. Some speed. I got speed for you. It's called Finish this room! White walls are not my design. Kathy, aren't you excited to see what I'm we're gonna sorry. do with this? Get up, up, up! Oh, okay. Try to make it back! You guys better be on your feet! Uh, higher. <laughs> oh my gosh! Wow, both of you are fired, but then I'm hiring you back. This is where the design starts to come alive. This was our refresher, and now we're gonna go style. 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 What's the deal with this trash can? Mm. For this bedroom design, I wanted to combine bold prints with luxe finishes for the perfect juxtaposition. To create a print, we're taking the room from trash to treasure and using a trash can lid to draw circle shapes in a random pattern. Next, we're gonna go over the pencil lines using a brush and some blue paint. The blue paint is a glossy finish, which is a perfect contrast against the flat white. Wow. wow. Whoa. That's pretty funky. I love it. It reminds me of bubbles or something like that. We're gonna bring in some glamorous items. So this is like our graphic wall, and then the glamorous stuff will be a juxtaposition to it. You're capturing me at every angle. Well, this is the last you're gonna see of this, though, for now, because I wanna finish this away from your... Well, actually, it's giving me some creativity, so I think I'll go write some rhymes. Ooh! Cassie's three amazing kids are gonna help her write some rhymes while we finish the room. Hey, you guys, I think I'm coming up with something here. What's here? Breaking beige into in living color. Used to be a fighter, Kate turned me to a lover. How's that sound? Good. Sounds That's good. good? Okay. Do you guys have anything else after that? Turn me to a lover. Like a mother? Uh, that sounds good. One big change we're gonna make is install some clean white sliding doors to keep her room looking serene. I got these store-bought sliding closet doors and now all I gotta do is cut down the tracks to fit inside the closet and we are good to go. Oh, Joey, that looks so good. Closet door. Sliding closet door. Oh my gosh. We're hanging a double curtain rod so that Cassie has the option of both sheer and dark drapes. If your view isn't much to write home about, sheer curtains are a great way to still let in the light without seeing your neighbor in their underwear. The curtain hanging time. Ooh, you the got time this? we hang the curtain. Do you have this? It's the funnest time of the I'm year. Getting that Hanging curtain. Yeah. Hanging curtain. <laughs> <laughs> Having both types of curtains.
curtains adds a sophistication to contrast with the funky wall. I'm gonna be really excited to take a shower tonight. I'm gonna be really excited for you to take a shower tonight too. Oh, that's mean. <laughs> it's time to bring in everything. Go! Ouch. Now I got a new room, no more gloom. So into tune? <laughs> yep, so into tune. That's like that. High five. That's a good one. We're just gonna add some softness for around the bed with a white shag rug. Okay. We got these two bedside tables at the thrift store, but they look brand new in this room. No more bed on the floor. We're giving her a bed frame and upholstered headboard to give it some height and majesty. You're so sweaty. A dust ruffle or bed skirt is an easy way to conceal a metal bed frame if all you have is a headboard. Head up. This vintage dresser that Kate and Cassie painted provides storage for Cassie's clothes and a surface for her TV. To make the bed look as sumptuous as possible, I'm adding a textured quilt and then folding a white duvet comforter into a tube a third of the way up from the foot of the bed. I'm hoping by mounting these animal heads, it will remind Cassie to tame her animal nature. First thing is this door. From anger and being frustrated from the, my living situation. Maybe just the animal heads are enough. We don't need the clock. I mean, the clock could be like... Down there. Maybe we don't need the clock. We have so many round things going on in here. This one's a hook. She could put like her like bling on this. It's a bling bowl. It's a bling bowl. I think it can go out slightly a little bit. Decor pieces in the color palette and an upholstered chair in the corner complete this swanky swag pad. The last piece. We're gonna seal this design. She better not punch a hole in this one. The final finishing touches, of course, the new hole-free door. Keep your eyes closed. Are you nervous? Yes, I'm nervous. Don't be nervous. One, two, three. Oh my God. <laughs> I feel so blessed right now. Aww. I'm so overwhelmed. What about your boy? That is crazy, right? <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, by the way, yeah. closet doors. Ah. <laughs> the beautiful oh double God. rod curtain. You got yes. your shears and your main curtain. So I can take the sun out and bring it back yeah. in. And you even incorporated my little Dom yeah. Dom. I yeah. can get so creative in here. I can just let my juices flow now. Guys. <laughs> It's a new life Whoa. for me, you guys, now. It's all up from here. Mm. And that's not just words, I'm so serious. It better not be that green color. Matter of fact, look at those shoes off here. Woo! You were amazing. We gotta go help some other people break some beige. Do what you do. All right. You guys are awesome. All right. Group hug. Group hug, yay! Yay! We'll we'll breaking beige. Love you, Cassie. Love See you later. Cassie. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Woo. So happy Cassie loves it. She's so cool. I really like her. Very cool. I'm so exhausted. I hope you guys love the transformation and of course comment because we'd love to hear from you. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see what other eps we have coming out. You never know, we may end up on your doorstep next. Email breakingbeige at mrkate.com and we will come see you hopefully and break some beige. 
Woo! Mr. Hayes! <laughs>